Let's go. So, my favorite club, obviously, is Arsenal Football Club, Arsenal FC. That's my childhood club. Been supporting them since 2006. They are by far the greatest club in England. I beg to differ, does any other club better than them? And yeah, London is great. And even though I didn't have much friends who support Arsenal or who couldn't support Arsenal you know, during my school days or, or college days, but Arsenal is probably be my club. Uh, why I love Arsenal? I mean, it's something like love at first sight. I mean, the way they play, the way they move, the way they pass the ball. I mean, I didn't know anything about football or anything or the rules uh, surrounding football, but then something about the club just, just, you know, just caught my eye. Just, you know, won, won me over and and been a fan ever since. The love at first sight. Uh, Let me see. We've had some of the greatest players the world have the world has seen to play at a Arsenal FC. So my pick would be uh, Thierry Henry, just for the fact that what a magnificent goal scorer, his goals, assist. But more than that, just the way he played the game. I mean, this he he embodied. What Arsene Wenger visioned Arsenal to play, and that was, that's that's all you want from a player. From a player, and his contribution in terms of not just goals, but in terms of his leadership and his sheer presence, everything around him is speaks that he is Mr. Arsenal. So he is my all-time favorite player. And my favorite game. Um, let me see. I mean, there are a lot of favorite games. I mean, a lot of disappointing moments, but at the same time, hey, what are you doing, man? Close the door. Two hours later. Ah, my favorite game. You know, that's difficult because I had a lot of enjoyable moments, a lot of disappointing moments but then I would say my favorite game would be 2014 FA Cup Finals because I supported Arsenal from 2006 so until 2014 we hadn't won anything any major trophy we rather lost in few few finals so uh, it was my first trophy seeing my favorite club win win something big and so I would say beating Hull City 3-2 in the FA Cup Finals. This is for me the best moment. Um, in today's team, my favorite player would be Mesut Ozil. Even though I love Ramsey, but since he's leaving, uh, just to just so I'm just not consider him, but Mesut Ozil just for the fact that he is a magician. Yes, he's been inconsistent and. He's had his fair share of doubts and sometimes he's played just as a passenger of the team but then when it's his game, he is class, he's out of this world and for the fact that Mesut Ozil is not just a, a, a great player, he brings in people, fans, uh, he brings in you know, what's it? he has a celebrity following, he, he, he is that person who can what do you say? Who can take Arsenal to the to the next level? Not just in terms of the quality of football, but in terms of the fan base and having this 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 ginormous, you know, a uh, world support, you know. So for me, it has to be Mesut Ozil. What I think about Wenger, you you know me. I'm a Wenger in guy. I've seen forever. Mr. Arsene Wenger, the boss, Papa Wenger, whatever you say. For me, he is, he is, 
he is Arsenal for me. For me, the fact that I've seen him all my life, all my life through school, through college, through engineering, through my masters, through everything, I've just seen one man day in and day out at the touchline. There were there were days when he's got things wrong, but the fact that he revolutionized this team, he changed how English football was played, he changed how people started to see English football and in particular, he changed Arsenal Football Club and nothing, no one can replace him, nothing in this world will replace my love for him, he is Papa Wenger, we don't need the money, we just can just change the name from Emirates Stadium to Asin Arena, I mean I would love to call it the Asin Arena but Let's see, I mean, hopefully in the coming years, things will change. Oh, so what I think about Unai Emery, Emery has been doing a great job. He is still getting into the whole Arsenal vibe, the language and the cultural difference. But he's getting there and he's doing a really good job for his first season at the club. So. So, I mean, what else, what else can I say? I mean, I hope we finish third and win the Europa League, which is a stretch. The fact that we are facing Napoli, but then you, know, you can never say Arsenal are one of the best team on any given day. And, and that difference is always a suspect. But we, going forward, I feel we can break down any team. like to add to this present day team I would like to add uh, a midfielder a defensive strong even though Torreira is the player we need for a long time but he's he is more of a Kante style player I like to have a strong huge massive presence in midfield someone like uh, Torre and, and Patrick Vieira someone who can I mean, someone like Pogba I would say I mean, Pogba, but then Pogba's not at his best at United, but someone like him who can just drive the team and hold the game by the by by the balls and and just, just make something click and and win something for the team. Yeah, and but defensively, I would like to add Kulabali or Umtiti just for the fact that their presence in defense would make. I mean, as I said. Our defense is always sketchy, a big suspect. Socrates is doing a great job. Alongside him, if you have someone strong, that's it done. Our defense is sealed. And I'm sure something will be, I mean, I'm sure Onamri is looking into that and I'm sure it will be fixed soon. So, to wrap things up, Arsenal are my life. They are everything to me. They are the club I love. Nothing can change. Through their disappointments, through everything, I'm going to stick with them. I'm going to stick with my manager, stick with my club. And I'm going to be a gunner for life. No matter what. Arsenal forever. In Arsene Wenger we trust. <laughs>